So are you feeling stuck as to why you really want to invest in multifamily real estate? Well, in this video, I'm going to share three tips with you that are going to help you get very clear exactly on that. Coming up. Hey there, it's Billy with Keep On Cash Flow, helping you to grow your money and your mindset so that you can get to the lifestyle that you really want to lead. Now on this channel, we'll be sharing lots of tips and strategy videos just like this. So if you're new to the channel, you should consider subscribing and you'll definitely want to make sure that you check out the links in the comments in the section below. But as for today, I want to help you get the clarity around why you should be investing in multifamily real estate. And if you stick around to the end of the video, I have a special treat for you. So I want to share three different tips with you that are going to help you get clearer as to why you want to be investing in long distance real estate. Now, these are some of the things that I've actually used. And so that's why I want to share them with you. And, the, and I'm going to give them to you from easiest to probably the most challenging. But the more time you spend, the clearer you're going to get. The clearer you're going to get, the better results you will ultimately achieve. So going to first, the first thing, you should really ask yourself the question, what are those feelings that make you come alive, to make you feel alive? That will be the first thing. So when you can get in touch with those feelings, it will help you understand why you want to continue to invest in long distance real estate. The second tip that I'd like to leave with you comes from a very famous book and or TED talk from a guy named Simon Sinek. And Simon Sinek has this concept that starts with the golden circle. Now, rather than understanding what you do, Simon says that you should start with why you do things. Uh, so when you can start with the why, then you can figure out how you do them and then ultimately what it is that you will do, which is invest in long distance real estate. And the third one, this is something that, I've come, that comes from my corporate background and it's one of the tools that it helps us to get the most clear on why we're doing anything. It's a tool called the five whys. It's actually used for root cause analysis, but you can also use it to get very clear as to why you're doing something. And I'm going to give you an example because it can be a little bit challenging. First of all, uh, why am I investing in real estate? Well, I'm investing in real estate because I want to uh, create more money. Well, why do I want to have more money? Because I'd like to be able to do more things with my family. Well, why would I like to do more things with my family? Because it makes me feel accomplished. And why does that make me feel accomplished? Well, it makes me feel accomplished because it helps to with with status or it could for you, it could be something else. But the question is, don't just stop with the first go through five whys and get to your ultimate why. And so now that you've stuck around to the end, here's the tip that I wanted to share with you. A lot of times when you're clear on why you want to do something, you're not necessarily clear on who you want to be able to serve. And this is where I see a lot, especially of beginning uh, long distance investors make mistakes. And let me give you an example. Uh, I love eating food and I love eating good food. So a lot of times we think about the Michelin restaurants. And so we know that Michelin has the highest is three stars. And there's a really famous restaurant in Paris called the Sank, or meaning the, the, the fifth at the George Saint Hotel in Paris. And there uh, they have the, the uh, Michelin three star restaurant. And could you imagine if you walked in to the sink and you actually saw the McDonald's greeter asking you, would you like fries with that? It would be kind of weird. And the same thing is with real estate investing. So if you can imagine, you want to make sure that who the, the resident that you want to serve matches the type of food that you're serving. So when you go to the Saint Hotel, you want to have five star treatment. When you go to a McDonald's, you're looking for something else. So not only being clear on why you're doing what you're doing, but be clear on who you want to be able to serve. So that's what I'd like to leave you with the question of the day. And today's question is, why have you decided that you want to get involved in long distance real estate investing? This is Billy Keels. That's my two cents for today. And as always, hasta la próxima sharing lots of tips and strategy.